what is going on people welcome back to another video on aj5 so in today's video guys it is all about storage so what i'm going to be doing today is looking at its price update price prediction as you can see two candlesticks in a row means it has been going up in value for the second day consistently or even the third day sorry i didn't see this one here third day consistently been going up in value so how high can it go by the end of the year bearing in mind we just about got two weeks left so how high can it go or how low can it go is your crypto worth investing into as a lot of people have been asking me is going up in value should i invest into it right now should i sell it should i wait for it to dip down so on and so on are tons of questions which i'm going to try and answer in today's video but before i get into all of that if you guys are new to the channel make sure to go down and smash that subscribe button as well as like the video as i'm trying to hit 40,000 subscribers by the end of the year and if i do hit that or if you guys help me hit that i will be doing a giveaway which will be announced on my instagram so make sure you follow me on instagram as well link to that will be in the description box down below so uh, storage is a top K, not one of the top gainers in the last 24 hours, gaining about 25% to make it $1.72. So, again, guys, this is no financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor, and anything I say is from my own prediction and my take on this crypto. And any gains or losses you guys make, I will not be responsible for. So, 25% up here, however, for the week, it is 10% down. We have all seen the major crash or dip, whatever you want to call it, over the last couple of days with the new COVID variant and so on, which has had a major, major effect on the whole crypto market. But at the moment, it is going up in value. And over the month, it is just about 2% down. So uh, we can see that it did hit about the $3.50 mark in late November and dipped all the way back down to, let's have a look, $1.35. So it's been very volatile over the last month up and down up and down all over the place and yes overall it is down we've got the market cap here of 608.2 million dollars the volume in the last 24 hours 166.3 million dollars and we've got a lot of people buying the dips a massive 78 percent buy against only 22 percent sell so we do have quite a bit of short-term traders who are in and out, in and out, buying and selling. But most people are holding on to it and we can see that they have been buying the dips quite well over the last couple of days. So, scrolling down here, a storage is on the rise this week as we can see here. It is not on the rise again, guys, because uh, I don't know if you guys know or not or may have heard Coinbase and Trust Wallet did ha get hacked or glitch. As you can see, it says all-time high of $1 billion. Yeah, storage did not hit $1 billion. Otherwise, it would have made um, you know a lot of millionaires out there. But yeah, that's not, that's not true. It's false. So um, hopefully, they get that fixed very soon as well. So going into the CoinMarketCap website, we can see 221% increase in the trading volume. So we've got way more people investing and selling this crypto over the last 24 hours so the trading volume has gone up by a massive amount so it's been getting a lot of attention a lot of people have been around it trading this crypto let me know what you guys have been doing have you been selling it or investing into it or are you just holding on to it the long term or are you trying to get into storage for the first time let me know what you guys are doing in the description box down below so going into the price prediction here we've got the candlestick pattern chart and at the top here we've got the macd indicator which is what we're going to be using to do the price prediction and i'm going to zoom in into the 30 minute chart for the short-term traders a lot of people are short trading crypto as well for me that's i'm not into short-term trading i find it risky and i'd rather just hold on to it for the long run over the next couple of years to you know see my portfolio grow over time but uh, short-term trade does work for some people and yeah if you're making money that quick why not guys so zooming in here over the next 30 minutes not 30 minutes sorry next couple of hours uh, we can expect it to slightly dip in value we've got the orange line and blue line looking bearish going in a negative direction so do expect it to slightly dip in value again nothing major but we've got both the lines looking quite bearish so a uh, decrease in value is expected over the next couple of hours hopefully towards the end of the day uh beginning of tomorrow we should expect it to slightly drop probably around the $1.65 to $1.70 or even $1.60 we may see over the next couple of hours and this may be a good chance for the dip buyers to buy the dips and yes guys finally we do have a lot of green uh here before it used to be all red 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 or for the last couple of days it has finally i wouldn't say recovered but on the way to recovery it is slowly starting to recover so moving on to the hourly chart next couple of days what can we expect still looking bearish we've got the blue line and orange line looking bearish going in a negative trend so it looks like more decreases in value are expected over the next couple of days so towards the end of the week beginning of next week we should expect it again to slightly take a dip in uh, value and again of course there will be dips there will be peaks in between it's going to be up and down but the overall outcome seems to be more on the negative place rather than the positive place 
play some in positive side moving on to the final one the daily chart the long term one we've got the blue line starting to go up in a positive direction however the orange line is still looking bearish going in a negative trend so overall do expect it to be uh, up and down up and down again very similar to the last one for the next couple of weeks so towards the end of the year beginning of january we should expect it to fluctuate at the current price range however i'm telling you guys this now it will change 100 percent this price prediction will change depending on how the covid variant you know how the government goes about it not just say in the uk but in the us and all over the world <clears throat> and restrictions and lockdown rules so on and so on i i am expecting it to get stricter over time over the next couple of weeks especially after christmas i'm probably thinking we're gonna go into a lockdown with the way it's going right now is just insane so that could have a major effect on the whole crypto market stock market and all of that stuff so i'm going to try and keep you guys updated as much as possible on my instagram page and on my youtube channel so make sure to stay subscribed and turn on the bell notifications to get notified every time i upload because this is very important guys the covid variant has the major effect and yeah it's affecting all of us especially people who have heavily invested into crypto and stocks as well but yeah these are my predictions and my takes on this crypto guys don't forget to comment down below your end of year prediction on storage what price target are you guys expecting storage to hit by the end of the year i want to see how many of you guys are bullish on it and how many of you guys are bearish on it so let me know what your predictions are <clears throat> but yeah that is pretty much it guys for today's video hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure to leave it a like and if you didn't leave it a like as well so either way go down and smash the like button and subscribe to the channel let's try and hit over 100 likes on this video and let's try and hit over 40,000 subscribers by the end of the year and i will be doing a giveaway and also if you guys have any future video suggestions like a different crypto that you guys want me to focus on let me know in the comment section down below as well or you can also dm me on instagram and i'll be going through all your comments later on uh, once you've commented of course <clears throat> but yeah thank you so much for watching guys i uh, appreciate each and every single subscribers out there keep supporting and i'll keep giving back and that is the motive on this channel with christmas around the corner it's only right that i do some giveaways and especially crypto giveaways so make sure to stay subscribed and more giveaways will be coming soon but yeah that's pretty much it thank you so much for watching guys i'll catch all of you in my next crypto update which should be later on today and again any suggestions you have that's what i'm going to be uploading and yeah thanks so much for watching i'll catch all of you in my next video until then take care and peace